We're here on Pier 54, which was the old Cunard Line Pier, maybe most famous because it was where the Carpathia docked, which was carrying the survivors from the Titanic. Right across the way is the Gansevoort Destructor Plant, a former incinerator which burned a lot of New York City's garbage. In 1956, the FDA burned materials belonging to the fringe psychologist Wilhelm Reich. Reich was a former student of Freud. He emigrated to the U.S. just before World War II and settled in Forest Hills. And he's mostly known for his theory of the orgone, which was a kind of cosmic, biological, libidinous energy. And also for his invention of the orgone accumulator, which was a box made out of alternating layers of metal and organic material that concentrated the orgone rays. And if you sat in the box, you could experience well-being and possibly even cure cancer. So in the 1950s, the FDA took notice of Reich's claims for the organ accumulator, as well as the sexual overtones of most of his research. This resulted in a federal court injunction against Reich, which banned his books and forbade the transport of the organ accumulators across state lines. Just a short while later, Reich violated the injunction and was sentenced to two years in federal prison for contempt of court, where eight months after he was put in prison, he died of heart failure. In 1956, the FDA burned several tons of his books and other materials and the orgone accumulators in the Gansevoort destructor stations in what was most likely a veiled act of censorship.